Everybody. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Free go karts like, when will danger start this clickbait? Now, the clickbait starts now! Damn it! <laughs> Hello, oh man. I forgot to turn on my, my intro from uh, from from yesterday. I had to I had to turn it off when I switched back and forth once. So like there's like a awkward moment where I'm just sitting here before the intro started. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Hello everybody, Captain Boot Hats here. Captain Boot Hats says it's loud. Stupid low volume Netflix? Really? Let me check. Let me double check. Because it might have been reset. I don't know. It's impossible for me to know. So let me just double check to make sure. But uh, hello everybody. Awesome Joe's here. Um, hold on one moment while I check this bullshit. No, I'm good. Okay, I'm good. All right, I'm fine. Um, RCJ Queenie's here. Uh, it was having some Wi-Fi issues, I guess. Neil T, hello. Enigma Champ is here. Lone Wolf is here. JJ Collins just cheered. <laughs> Take it and like it. Okay, I like it. I like it, JJ. I like it. Thanks for the cheer. <laughs> uh, Daenerys is here. We got JV Gamer. Um, it says, I wonder how many times Danger's going to die this time. None. I won't die at all. Missy Lambert? Hey! <laughs> Missy Lambert's like, nice costume, danger. Oh, shit, I forgot it's Halloween. Fuck, do I have a costume? Hmm, I might. <laughs> Magnum 520! Hey man! <laughs> thanks for the thanks for the cheer. Oh, hello, danger. Well, hello, Magnum 520. Oh, read read Go Kart is here. Oh man. Captain Boot Hat, I don't know if I said hi or not. I can't remember. I I don't know. I said hi to Mick Davis. So say hello to me. Well, that helps. <laughs> Enigma Champ, thanks for the bits. <laughs> uh, eat, eat my bits. Also, a whole day lit firework again. I won't be doing that again. Um, <laughs> uh, Narwhal says, you still have that dino costume from a year or two ago? Did I ever do a stream with the dino costume on? Did I ever fit in that thing? I don't know where it is. I gotta be honest. I don't know where it is. I'm looking. I don't... My place is a fucking wreck, okay? I can't find anything. Everything's gone. The best that there is here, Waleed Benali. Oh, man. Desiru. Hi. Uh, <laughs> uh, th three Kappas. To no flipping over and dying. Okay, you got it. I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, and load the pain. I'm loading the pain. Oh, jeez. So how's everybody doing today? I'm doing great. <laughs> Do a burger stream instead. Oh, man, I want a burger bad. I would, I would, I would destroy a burger right about now. <laughs> James Jumbo is here, like, says, wait, what firework? Oh, you weren't here yesterday. So that means that you, uh, you're gonna miss it forever. Okay, so I did a little, uh, a little work after the stream last night, because I wanted to get things sorted. Um... I wanted, I wanted to make sure that things were going to go smoothly, which is why I, I'm doing this so close to the last time I streamed. I d streamed the last one yesterday, and I've never done, like, two My Summer Cars in a row. But what I did is, uh, uh, first off, I did a I did a wood hauling job, so I got some money now. Uh, as you can see, the trailer's out there. I, I, I loaded up some logs, took them over to the guy. <laughs> James is like, I was asleep, Mango. Uh, here's, here's what I did. I actually went to, um, Flatari, and he had whole pistons for me to install. Um, and I, and I am, I'm happy to, uh, to report that I can just install these top down through here. Now, what they didn't have, what he didn't sell me was, uh, was this main bearing over here that I just have one of. I don't know... I, I, I'm pretty sure this is what holds the crankshaft in, but um, but I look through the I look through the log file like the uh, I look through the game files, and it says that all three are installed. So fuck if I know. <laughs> so so basically, it doesn't actually see that this is missing. So maybe there's a bug where it just falls out, and then, but it's not actually gone. Maybe I don't actually need it. Yeah. So we'll see. 
We'll see. I'm going to put it back together. Um, and, uh, and we'll see. Uh, Tessaru's like, it's, it's an, it's an, uh, an i4 engine. I thought it was a V4. Where the hell have you seen a V4 engine? <laughs> I've never seen a V4 engine. All four cylinder engines I've ever seen were, uh, were of two varieties in line uh, the i4 and, uh, uh, what else? Um, the, uh, the flat four boxer, the boxer engine, flat four or H4. It's that some people call them cause they're, it's like an H it's an H configuration. <laughs> oh man. Uh, but hello everybody. Ruben Peters is here. Who Ruben Peters is handing out candy right now. Who's, who's, uh, who's handing out candy? Uh, show of hands, show of hands. Crazy mixed up pup is here. Happy Halloween. Guess you're torturing yourself getting into the spirit with this game. Ah, I see because it's like. It's like torture. I get it. <laughs> oh, man. Bad News Brian is here. Um, Nightmare Creator says, Doge made a V4, but they didn't do it for long. Well, Doge is a dog meme, so I, I can understand. Oh, shit. Huh. Maybe, maybe I can't do this. It gives me the option. Uh-oh. Now I can't install it. <laughs> uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, am I bugged now? I think I'm bugged. I'm bugged out now. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Wait. Oh shit. The crankshaft. <laughs> God damn it. Son of a bitch. The crankshaft just fell out. <laughs> <laughs> oh god okay well <laughs> wait maybe i can just put it back in hold on let's see let me just <laughs> god damn it we just put that back in there um uh, no it's it's not gonna go i'm gonna have to take the oil pan off now shit i was hoping i wouldn't have to do this oh man well, <laughs> this is uh, this is how my day is going. How's how's everybody else's day going? I'm doing great. Happy Halloween, everybody! <laughs> Josephur is like, this is freaking perfect. <laughs> Quiet, Joseph. I don't want to hear it. Oh, the uh, the power went out. Oh, that's spooky. Oh, that's spooky. Oh, jeez, I'm getting a little bit of lags. Getting a little bit. JV Gamer's like, great start, Danger. Thanks, JV. Oh, yeah, also I got a new uh, new head gasket. Gave me a new head gasket. So I wonder if since uh, since this is now out of the car, out of the engine, I mean, if, uh, if it'll give me more stuff to buy, like these pistons, for example. Oh, I can't get the pistons out. Oh, this is bad. The pistons are stuck in there. Oh shit. God damn it. <laughs> Universal Deadshot, hey man. Oh man. Wally Pinelli's like, Danger needs a you need you need a new CPU, Danger. Yeah, I know. Actually, uh, a lot of people ask me, like, how much is it gonna cost to, to do all to to upgrade your computer? So, um, through the through the Streamlabs donation link, you're able to also do a wish list, and I kind of I put it there just as like a a place to point people that don't really know how much this stuff costs because a, a lot of people ask me they're like how much will it cost and I never have an answer I never because I'm like I don't know like the, you know I could get I could go with this and then this and then this so I so I went through and I found links for like a rough approximation. And, uh, man, it's a lot more than I thought. <laughs> it's, it's not, it's not great. <laughs> uh, Adidas says, danger, use a sledgehammer. That will get them out. Good point. Good point. Uh, okay, so I gotta, I wonder if I can just take the oil pan off without taking the transmission off. That's my question right now. Can I take this oil pan off? 
Let's get these wrenches a little bit closer. I mean, this, this is a video game, so it's not like... Yeah, I, I, sh I should be able to just pull this pan off. Like, right through... I mean, the fucking crank came right through the goddamn case. <laughs> oh, Narwhal, thanks, thanks for the cheer, man. He said, uh... It says for a new CPU and for your sorrows, it uh, it helps with my sorrows, but not so much with a new CPU to be honest. <laughs> I uh, honestly like I've been I've been thinking about it, and I'm like I should just get a part-time job just so I can upgrade my computer. <laughs> it's so scary though. Like it, every time I look at a job, this is what happens. Like it's like I don't know. I don't know how many people out there are of the age where you have to work for a living. But every time you look at a job, you have to you have this little voice in your head that's like, hey, you're not good enough for that job. It's a shit job and it's not even you're not even good enough for that. Oh, you'd be garbage at it. You know? <laughs> Cause like they, they always they always use such colorful language when they're describing the responsibilities of the position. They always want somebody with like fantastic organizational skills and the fucking best customer service and like and like a bachelor's degree a, a master's a master's degree and like 10 years experience and it's like fuck it's just Walmart come on give me a fucking break <laughs> uh god damn i cannot I cannot. I cannot. I cannot. It's a it's a depressing process, is what I'm saying. If you've if you've ever had to do it, I know a lot of people are young and they haven't they haven't had to go out into the workforce yet. But like, like it's basically like somebody standing there and saying, "Why do you deserve to have a job?" And you're like, "I don't know. <laughs> I'm bullshit." <laughs> I'm not good enough to work at Walmart. <laughs> that's uh, that's basically that's basically my experience, anyways. <laughs> uh, yeah, James Esposito is like, I want somebody who's just willing to fucking work. And sometimes, as, as an employer, it's insanely difficult to find that, right, James? Like, you want somebody that's just invested enough to show up every day and put in an honest day's work and it's like how how come I can't find that and how come and like as somebody who wants to be employed why can't I just put that on my resume like I want to work I want to and then they're like oh shit this guy wants to work <laughs> fine I this is my guy he he wants to show up there we go all right perfect I got it I mean, this thing's gonna be a fucking nightmare to put back together because I'm doing it all. Ba Is that a hole? There's a fucking hole in my oil pan. You see this shit? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> There's a hole. That I can't. Where'd it go? It's gone. <laughs> my oil pan's gone. <laughs> Oh no, wait. Oh, it's up here. It's up here. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? <laughs> wow. I didn't know that it would do that in this game. There's legit a hole in the oil pan. <laughs> it actually threw a rod through the oil pan. Oh my god. Oh. Now how do I get these pistons out? <laughs> it's not going to let me, is it? I don't think it's going to. It only lets me touch the block. <laughs> and honestly, I bet I need a new block, too. Let's just... Okay. Fuck. This is a fucking nightmare. <laughs> Maybe Champ's like, to Flatari's! Yeah. <laughs> McDavis is like, is that even possible in real life? It's possible in real life, yeah. I've seen it. I've seen it happen. But in the game? I didn't know it was possible in the game. Holy jeebus. 
No, no wonder. No, no fucking no wonder, man. Can I get? I'm gonna take the transmission off. I'm just gonna take everything off. When I was at Flatari's, okay, so I could, I checked the game files, right? Because I'm like, what actually needs to be replaced? And it told me, it was just, it was just, uh, you know, piston uh, three, two and three. So I'm like, cool. I get there, they have piston two and three and a block, and I'm like, what? A new block, really? Um, and yeah, they uh, they straight up gate. They want me to buy a new block, which is expensive. Um, it's expensive, but uh, uh, fuck. What's my point? I don't know what my fucking point is. Hold on a second. I gotta I gotta unbolt this shit. This fucking this fucking garbage. Oh my god, I can't believe there's a fucking hole in the block, or in the, in the oil pan. Oh my god, what a goddamn nightmare. Oh jeez. Now I gotta play fucking Wren Wrenchy Guess. Wrenchy Guess is the, is the name of the game today, boys and girls. It's all about... I wasn't even looking at the right goddamn bolt. We're, play we're playing Wrenchy Guess, where we guess what size wrench we need. Because there's no other way to figure out what fucking size wrench you need other than just guessing every goddamn size. Uh. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Wrenchy guess. Everyone's favorite game. <laughs> it's America's favorite game. Wrenchy guess. You guess what fucking size you need. At least in this game, all of my tools are organized. <laughs> if this was real life, I'd have wrenches all over the place. There we go. Uh, that should have done it. Should have done it. Should have done it. Should have done it. It didn't do it. What else do I have to do? That should be it. That should be everything, but it's not. Fuck. <sighs> I'm about to fucking drink myself to death. What? Hold on. Where's my water pump? Oh, that's wait. That's the. Oh, that's crank. Okay, the crank. That's and that's over here. Okay. Whew. Jesus Christ! For a second, I thought I was missing a water pump. <laughs> I'm just looking at the block upside down. Um. Oh, don't don't fall over. I gotta be missing a bolt. Um, oh, uh, see see you later, RCJ Queenie. She's gotta go. She's gotta go. She gotta go. Maybe it's uh it's this over here. Let's see. I got those bolts. Oh, I'm missing one right there. Uh, let me let me grab whatever size wrench that was. Is it this one? Yeah, it's this one. Okay. I was missing one. I missed it. <laughs> hey, bad news, Brian. Thanks for thanks, uh, beer bits. Thanks for the beer bits, bad news, Brian. <laughs> uh, which is perfect because Universal Deadshot says, you know what you need, danger? A beer. Well, I don't have a beer, but I'll tell you what I do have. The next best thing. I got an os. <laughs> it still won't come off. Come on. Come on. Come on. What am I what am I missing? Let's let's take a closer look. What what am I what am I fucking dealing with here? What the fuck am I dealing with? Oh, you know what? Maybe Maybe it's that deal you have right there. The uh, fucking the clutch, clutch f for clutch, cil clutch cylinder, clutch plunger, clutch plunger. Is that it? I fucking don't remember what the half of this shit is called. All right, let me let me get the plungy plungy clutcher. Uh, fucking, I gotta move this. This is the worst possible setup ever. Ah. Uh. <laughs> 
<laughs> what a fucking nightmare. My whole shop is a nightmare. This this was a perfect a perfect Halloween game because this is a fucking nightmare. This whole setup. This whole this whole bullshit going on. What a what a goddamn nightmare. <laughs> scariest scariest thing I've ever done. <laughs> Uh, um, oh, uh, also speaking of NAS, Danger, you can get some in the catalog for your car. That's the last thing I need right now, is nitrous oxide. <laughs> it's literally, literally the last thing I need is nitrous. Literally the last thing I need. Fucking, how big is this bolt? It can't be that big. There is a bolt here, right? Yeah, there is a bolt right here, and it cannot be that big. It's got to be the smallest one. It's such a small... Is it a bolt? Is there a bolt here? You know, I think these are just the texture of a bolt. I don't think... I don't think that actually comes off. Yeah... And then there's just this over here. Kind of like this bolt. That's that's just a texture of a bolt. Oh, hey. Fuck. All right. I, I just did it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. That, that came off. It came off, though. Oh, Jesus Christ. What a goddamn nightmare this is. This whole fucking thing is a nightmare. So how the hell, how, how does one, wait, you know what? Maybe if I undo, hold on, let me get this. Oh man. Um, Enigma Champ says, danger, my cousin somehow broke his engine crank and had to buy a new one. Yeah, you can, uh, you can, you can do that. Usually, usually that's when you, uh, when you seize a piston, like you're running it without oil. And it seizes, and uh, and it goes ahead and fucking snaps your your crankshaft while it's at it. You know, as like like uh, you know, just in case things couldn't get any worse. Basically, is the idea. All right, so here's what I'm thinking. I'm gonna grab. Hold on, I'm gonna grab this whole fucking set and put it here. Let's see. Um, if I take off these guys. Maybe I can get the pistons out. Which I think is going to be an important step for reinstalling the crankshaft. You know, one would assume. One would assume. Alright, and... Uh, come on. <laughs> It still doesn't give me the option for pulling the goddamn pistons out. Oh my god. Okay. Well, <laughs> looks like I'm heading to Flatari's house. <laughs> uh, Alright, what time is it? It's 10 o'clock. Okay, perfect. Perfect time to go to Flatari's house. Great time, in fact. Fantastic time. Where's my van? Oh, right. Oh, hey. So, I had an idea. An idea for free food. Um, <laughs> uh, Messy Lambert says, wouldn't it be easier to get a new one from the catalog? What, a new motor? Unfortunately, that's not an option. Um, <laughs> and, uh, and new parts... They, they have to be broken and missing from the car before I have the option to buy them at Flatari's shop, unfortunately. Um, Damian Matthews, hey! Oh, and Chad's in here! Hey, Chad! Chad has a very special evening lined up. Very special. And he tweeted out about it. And, uh, and, he, and he needs some input. 
if you know what I mean. <laughs> wink. Wait, wink. Wink. <laughs> oh, okay. Chad says it's not this evening. I thought it was this evening. In which case, I was like, wow, that is special. On Halloween? That's special. Either way, you need suggestions. Oh, right. I was going to show you the thing. So, check this out. I was... I, I just I went back to the I went back to the island because I'm like I want to do some fishing but I was like why do that when I could just bring the fish trap over here now I don't know if I can catch fish over here I'd, I'd assume that I can I mean why not but uh but but nonetheless I'm going to catch fish and then just take them inside and cook them in my fireplace, and then I'll always have free fish. Free food. And, because, like, you catch so many fish. Like, so much. Um, oh, also, I went around, I went to the junkyard. Oh, I found my, I found my hood. This thing's been missing for the longest time. I found that. Found all my old juice frog containers, and picked up my coolant and oil cans, and two-stroke whatever the fuck fuel I topped off the van with fuel I filled up the god the, the fuel tanks I did a lot yesterday just to, just so that I don't have anything getting in my way to work on this god damn en fuck fucking engine build today anyways there we go <laughs> the unknown knows says uh uh, so no GM performance catalog? No, no, unfortunately. That is one great thing about, like, at least if you're in the States, trying to, like, rebuild a, a V8 is so much easier than trying to bit rebuild, like, a Japanese motor. Because, like, there's just catalogs out there where you can just buy parts. You can buy entire motors if you wanted to. You can just, you can just buy whatever you want. And it's like, it's, and it doesn't cost like several arms and legs. And then when you, when you buy it and you put it all, slap it all together and put it in a car, it, it, it runs. It runs like the way it's supposed to. <laughs> Almost like it was designed for it to fit in there. Oh man. Anyways, there we go. Now hopefully when I get to Flatari's house, he's got the parts that I need. I hope. I don't, I don't know. I have no idea. You need beer and food danger. I have beer. And I just ate food. I ate fish. I've got tons of fish. I've got so many fish. You wouldn't believe it. <laughs> Tasmania. Hey, man. He says, put on your seatbelt. I, I don't, oh. Are, really? Really? Oh, uh, Really? As, wait, how long has this been a thing, Tasmania? I... I did not know that this was a thing. <laughs> I really didn't. Is this new? This has to be new. I've never... I've never known about this. I know that you could do it with a, with a racing harness, but I did not know that you could do it with a, seat, with a regular seatbelt. Yeah, exactly. Enigma Champ's like, there's a seatbelt? <laughs> Oh, man. Yeah, Neil T's like, no way. I wonder how... Because, like, in the with the racing harness, you can survive a pretty... A pretty crazy crash, as long as you have your, your safety harness on. I wonder if the seatbelt's the same way. I might just... I might just have raised my, my survivability, like, by a lot. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, man. Nightmare Crater says, no, it's always been there, Danger. I don't know, Nightmare Crater. Sometimes it sounds like, like you're making things up. Just saying. Some, sometimes, sometimes your information isn't 100%. Um, <laughs> I think the champ's like, test it out, Danger. I don't wanna. <laughs> I really don't wanna. I don't wanna to, out. trust me, there'll be plenty of opportunity. For me to fucking kill myself. Like, uh, like right now. 
Okay. I'm just going to have to chance it. Okay, we're good. At least in that direction. I know a lot of people always ask me why I take the railroad track, but it's so much easier and faster than taking the road. It's so much faster. I mean, granted, I don't have to, like, drive, like, the, the train doesn't come at me and I have to drive off into the, into the fucking marsh over there and get stuck. I really think they need to fix that. They need to either like put some some mud textures there, or they need to do something. I don't know what, but they need to do something. I think that's the train. That's yep. That yep yep. That's the train. That's the train. Shit. Oh. Woo. Oh, just just missed it. It's worth the risk, you know. It's worth the risk. <laughs> Your seatbelt might save you. It might. Then again, who knows? Oh, Narwhal with the uh, with a link for uh, for for Chad's Chad's uh, Chad's tweet about what to do. It sounds like fun though. Um, I got to I got to hang out with Kim for a little bit when we went to New Jersey, and that was and she's she's a pretty cool person. I mean, granted, I already knew that. <laughs> I didn't need to meet her in person to know that she was kind of cool. But, uh, but she's fun. She's fun to be around. So no matter what, I'm sure it's going to be a lovely time. Unless people st have no idea what I'm talking about. <laughs> Tragic. Hey, Tragic's here. He says, you have a seatbelt now. You could have taken that train. <laughs> I'm not... I still don't want to risk it, you know? I don't want to risk it. Okay, so here I am. Rocked you like a hurricane. Um, now... Oh shit, of course. Man, I cannot believe that there's a seatbelt. <laughs> I mean, I should have known. And of course that's going to be something that the developer says nothing about. Of course it is. Oh yeah, okay, check it out. Okay, so here's a crankshaft. These are all the things that I took off. Oh, okay. So here's two more pistons. Piston, oh. I've already got piston two and three. Okay. An engine block. Gearbox. Oil pan, I need the oil pan for sure. That's a fact. I need that oil pan. Yeah, I guess I don't need the fucking whatever. Do I need a crankshaft? I mean, I don't think it was dead. Well, fuck, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I think my champ's like, where's the bag of fireworks? It's, uh, <laughs> it's in the woodshed behind the house. <laughs> it's a long story. <laughs> it's a long story. Okay. That's going to be 500. You know what? I'm just going to buy a new crankshaft. Let's just be on the safe side. All right? I threw I threw two pistons. It probably needs a new a new crankshaft. But here's the thing that worries me. Those uh those those uh those main bearings, they're not here. And they've never been here. I've never had the option to buy new main bearings. So I might get this I might slap this thing back together. And it's still just, you know, oh, shit. Should I buy a new block? Fuck. <laughs> I kind of wish I could roll this over and see. Because, like, maybe, did they just come installed on this? or No, I don't think so. Because the main bearings, they go, they go across here, where the, where the crankshaft goes in. Right there. They go on the other side. And they, they keep the crankshaft from slapping around like a... Like a fucking... Uh, snake. In the grass. Here's the thing, though. I think that if I click on that, everything that's installed on that block 
disappears, I think. Because I think it, like, legitimately replaces everything. So I might be totally fucked. Um, it's possible. I, I don't I don't really know. I don't know. <laughs> uh, fuck it. I'm buying it. I'm gonna buy it. Not enough money. Shit. Oh, I forgot. I thought it was okay. All right. I was gonna buy the. I'm gonna. I'll buy the crank then. All right. There we go. See, I knew there was a reason why I didn't buy it before. Okay. Hey, look at this. So it just teleported this whole thing to me, right? Which is what I had sitting. Like I had the clutch installed. I had the flywheel installed. I had the pulley installed, but the crankshaft is new. Ah, see? See? All right. Um, <laughs> now, I've got the oil pan here without a hole in it, and it has dipstick installed. It has that mount installed. Okay. All right, so there's no risk. There's no risk. It just basically, it teleports it here and makes it undamaged. So, perfect. All right. This is fantastic news. Okay. This actually this actually helps in a big way. Um So these guys, I've already got these. So I don't need to rebuy these. And uh and the head gasket I've also replaced. And these are just parts that I've taken off the car. Uh So I I got to assume that everything's okay, right? Like, everything's going to be all right. Everything is going to be all right. That's all I can do, is I can just assume. That's all I can do. That's all I got. Now, time to fasten my seat belts. Oh, my God. I can't fucking believe that this has been a thing. How long has this been a thing? Hey, T-Rice, hey, man. <laughs> Oh, man. Uh, Neil T is like, I like the hole. Made it easier for draining. <laughs> you know, here's a secret. You know those 10-minute oil change places? You got to be careful with some of those guys. Here's the thing. A lot of times what they do is they drill a hole in your oil pan instead of pulling the old plug out. And they just use a, um, they're, they're like a, a cell, like a, an expanding, um, an expanding plug, uh, uh, an expanding freeze plug. Basically, you turn it and it like it pushes some rubber bushing out and it makes a seal. And they'll put those in. And there's nothing wrong with that, but it's kind of like they don't tell you that they do it. So like they basically just drill a hole so that they and don't even bother with the with the drain plug. And then they put a different plug in that can leak. Also, there was a place in Georgia that got, that was, uh, that was, um, they did a police thing because people, people thought that they were up to some shady business. And what they did is instead of changing oil, they would pull out the dipsticks and spray paint them gold so that it looked like the oil was new. Isn't that fucked up? So they basically just pull out a dipstick, spray paint it gold, and then put it back in, and then just... Leave, send you on your merry way. Yeah, <laughs> a no no says, uh, which is Eric Reardon. I, I, I'm, I'm in, I'm in reading names mode right now. <laughs> so those fuckers always strip the plug, and it's probably for the best. But I, it's kind of fucked up that they don't tell you that that's what they do. Because I mean, it does make for oil changes to be a lot easier, right? But uh, oh, jeez. Oh, uh, Norm Abram says, is this live version or experimental? This is experimental. I've been playing on experimental for, like, the past couple streams that I did of this. Um, but, but before that, I did, I did only live builds. Okay. Here comes, uh, here comes gamble time. Here comes a big gamble. Proctor and Gamble. They make soap. 
They make like almost all the soap, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin Boo hat's like, like holy fuck, that's ballsy, right? Because they get, like, they did a police sting and they caught him, and they're they're like, you guys, you guys are, are defrauding people. And it's like, it's a fucking oil, like a ten minute oil change place. All they do is oil changes. Like, how hard is it to change, fucking oil? You know. How cost prohibitive is it to, to to do an oil change? Oh shit, the train's behind me. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, oh. Oh boy. Oh boy. Shit. Shit. Oh my god. Whew. All right. Well, everything worked out. <laughs> hey, there's the train. I saw it back there and I was like, I gotta get off the road! <laughs> but I didn't want to do it in the marsh, though. There we go. Alright. <laughs> Look at the tire tracks through the trees. Oh my god. Oh man. Hey, Simple Man! What's up? Thanks for stopping by. Oh, oh jeez. Shit. 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 Oh. Oh. Oh boy. All right, we're good. <laughs> All thanks to the seatbelt, everything worked out. Actually, I haven't needed it yet. I haven't, uh, I haven't hit anything. But you know what? I think, uh, I think it'll, I think it'll do the job. I think it'll, uh, I think it'll save my life. Which will save me a lot of time, really. That's really all it does. It'll just save me time, not having to die and walk back to the car. <laughs> Keyword yet. <laughs> That's right. Oh man, a slayer of bulls leaving. I didn't even know you were here, man. But uh, but thanks for stopping by. See you later, man. Oh oh jeez. Oh fuck. Oh man, that could have been bad. That calls for a beer. Holy shit. This whole time I've been not drinking nearly enough beer. There we go. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. I did load everything up, right? Yeah, yeah. I threw it in the back. Okay, good. <laughs> Nightmare Crater says there's a seatbelt in all cars, danger. Well, I mean, now that I know about this one, I assume there would be. It's just that they've. <laughs> I've never noticed it before. I've never thought to look, to be honest. I've never seen anybody use one before. All right, there we go. It's not like anybody in the chat ever told me that there was a seatbelt before today. Can't act, can't act like I've like I've just been merely ignoring your your sage wisdom, knowing that there's a seatbelt in all cars. Really. Really, you've just been stringing me along, if we're, if we're being honest. This whole time, nobody's told me about the seatbelt. This is your fault. All your fault. This is all your fault. You guys. You let me down by not telling me about the seatbelt. Just saying. Um, oh, right. Let me get the... Let me get the shit. I need the shit. <laughs> You're probably too drunk to notice. <laughs> all right. What, what are you? My driver's license? Jesus Christ. Hiya! Okay, and uh, I'll throw the hood out there too. <laughs> I haven't had a hood in so long. I lost it, if you remember. And it wasn't until uh, yesterday that I found it again. There we go. Missy <laughs> Lambert's like, you didn't want spoilers. I mean, true, I don't. But people gave me spoilers anyway. <laughs> and having a seatbelt in the car would have would have been the best spoiler to have. <laughs> you know, 
you know, people people spoiled things like the fact that there's an axe murderer walking around that will give me a million dollars. That's been spoiled. So I won't even look for the million dollars. I don't give a shit about million dollars. I'm not I'm not going after it because I've already it's already been spoiled for me. But a seatbelt? I'll use a seatbelt like you won't believe. Get out of here, spray paint. All right, so let's uh, let's give this a shot. Um, oh shit! <laughs> is this gonna work? I don't know if this is gonna work or not. I really hope it works. I want this to work, but sometimes things don't work just because I want them to. You know. Uh, shit. Where's it gonna give me? Give me the sauce. Give me the sauce. Where's the sauce at? Give it to me. Shit. God damn it. It's not gonna go in. It's It's not going in. And I don't like it. Because it's not going in. I don't know why it's not going in, but it's giving me the business, and I don't like it. Oh, let me just, uh, let me get closer. Maybe I get closer, and I do this, and I can just stab it in. Wait, ooh. No? Okay. Yeah, it's not gonna let me put this uh, crankshaft in. Might I, I might need to take the serpentine off. That might that might be the problem. That might be it. If I can. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. <laughs> how how does one get the fan belt off? Oh my God. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to loosen the alternator probably. I'm gonna have to loosen all kinds of things. I didn't, I didn't sign on for this. Hey, hold on. Ah, there we go. There we go. Um, Adidas says, maybe you need to take the bearings off first. There, But there aren't any. Like, I can't take these out. It won't let me. That's just the block. As far as, as this game is concerned. That's just there now. The, uh, the connecting rods... Yeah, that's just... Unless I can get closer. Oh, wait. There we go. I gotta get real close. I gotta get super close. Come on. Come on. Oh, God, it was so close. The, uh... <laughs> The 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 yeah the hitbox for removing a piston is like it's minuscule it's tiny. Maybe I just spam click around here. Maybe I just spam it. Spam spam spam. I mean, if this was real life, yeah, I'd I'd be having a hard time putting in a crankshaft if I already had some pistons in there already all bolted up. That would cause a problem. Oh, shit. I almost saw it. I think I saw it, like, right around here. It blinked for a second. For, like, a fraction of a second, it blunk. Maybe if I, uh, maybe I can rotate it and get it from the other side. Ooh, maybe I can get it from here. Maybe I can just phase through. Yeah, there we go. Just phase through the block. That's how you do it. All right. <laughs> Got the pistons out. Yeah, the uh, the, the 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 um, the bearing cap uh, is is not a physical thing in this game. It's just it, it's once you install the piston, it's there. All right, there we go. <laughs> Perfect. Just how you do it in real life. <laughs> I mean, I'm I'm at. A, <laughs> 
I'm at odds, not knowing if the, if it's easier or harder to do this in real life. Because <laughs> in real life, at least, you know, you can just drop the crank in. Um, I never did anything with the bottom end, if I'm not... If I'm not mistaken. I never messed around with the bottom end. Ah, oh, shit. This is close. Oh, my fatigue is up. Oh, wait. There's a timing chain right here. Oh, I forgot about that. Fuck. Okay. Oops. <laughs> All right. So I got, I got the fan belt off. Maybe that'll help. Come on, oil filter. Quit fucking around on me. Quit fucking around... This is serious. Hold on, let's let's get in nice and close here. Get that crankshaft in there nice and tight. Just get it, let's get it in, get it in. Just put it in. Just put it in. Just put it in. Right. Like this. Like this. I probably have to take that timing chain off. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> Fucking god damn it. <sighs> can't just drop it in. Have it be easy. No, it's, that's right. It can't be easy. If it was easy, then everyone would do it. Alright, so I gotta take this timing cover off. So, that's that's not too bad. That's nothing. That's, that's nothing. That's nothing serious. I mean, if this was real life, I'd, I'd have to have the timing cover off, right? I mean, why not? That'd be the first thing I would do. I'd have a gaping fucking hole in my oil pan, and I'd be like, maybe the timing's off. All that wish... You know how wishful thinking goes. You're just like, maybe it's some a different problem that's not as serious. Meanwhile, shooting balls of fire and chunks of metal out of the bottom of your goddamn... <laughs> engine <laughs> there we go now that's on the floor <laughs> uh, let's see now we get to play uh, guessy wrench it's kind of like flappy bird but it's called guessy wrench and it's nothing like flappy bird it's my favorite game guessy wrench Get it on iOS and Android. <laughs> uh, wait, do I even have to do that? Or, uh, I think I do. Alright. Timing gear. Yeah, it's part of the timing gear. Okay, cool. <laughs> Real life car building mod. More <laughs> more rounds of Guessy Wrench. That's right. I, I'm all about some Guessy Wrench. Tragic wants me to spray paint the engine block. I wish I could. It's, uh, unfortunately... It does not allow me to do so. Yeah. If I get in there nice and nice and close, like, nah. I'd really love to paint my uh, my valve cover, or rocker co cover, as I call it here. I think that'd be super cool. I think he needs to get on that shit. See you later, paint. Uh, what was I doing just now? <laughs> You know what I was doing right now? Oh, yeah. Mm. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh fuck yeah. <laughs> I haven't had a NOS in probably two or three weeks. And it is oh so good. <laughs> Paint the seatbelt before it gets too late. Tragic, I can't paint the goddamn seat. That doesn't even make sense, Tragic. <laughs> I wish, I wish, I wish there were, were more painting painting options for sure. Cause, uh, cause I'd like to, I'd like to paint the pulleys. That'd be cool. Have some some multicolor. Hey, check that out. Yeah, there we go. Got that installed. Perfect. Oh fuck. Oh, my water pump just fell off. God damn it. Oh, I guess it's not bolted in. Or is it? I don't know. 
I don't fucking know. Oh no. <laughs> Great. Fantastic. Goddamn water pump. Oh wait, no, this is just timing cover. Okay. Oh wait, I gotta put the uh <laughs> Okay. Oh man, I'm losing it. I'm fuck I'm losing it. I need to take a break. Hello everybody. <laughs> um Oh, Norm Abrams says I want a paintable van and to be able to replace the artwork like you can with your bedroom posters. Actually, I mean, I think you have to use a mod. Uh but I've seen I've seen people do uh custom paint jobs for like the the sewage truck, the tractor, the van, all kinds of stuff. Um but I do think you have to use a mod to do it. Um oh man. I need a beer. If I've ever needed a beer, it's now. That's a good enough place for a beer bottle, if I've ever seen one. Hey, Mr. Cham's here. Uh, how do you manage to drink so much while streaming and not take a toilet break? I, uh, when I worked for Dell, I, I rarely got to go to the bathroom because I was on the road all day. So, like, I just, I, I don't know, like, I don't actually drink that much. It's just, like, I wait until I stream to drink things, <laughs> you know? So like, so like all day today, I was pretty, I was fairly dehydrated, but then, uh, but then, uh, it came time to stream and I was like, all right, let's do this. Crack up in a, well, I drank a giant cup of coffee. But yeah. Look at this. Okay. So where's the, where's the rest of my bearings? <laughs> Okay. Uh, anyways, what was I talking about? I forget what I was talking about. <laughs> he uses empty cans. Stream bucket. But after? After I'm done, I'm like, I'm a water fountain, man. <laughs> I, I am a... I am a fountain... of urine. Yeah, so I... I I'm missing the other... the other uh, main bearings. And I may, I may need to cheat them back into existence if Flitari doesn't give me my my bearings, which I was there and he didn't give me the option for bearings. So fuck, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I could do. Guessy wrench is not going very well for me right now. I didn't skip a size. Oh, apparently it's the last one. The last possible one I could try. Of course. Oh, what if I just ran one main bearing? That'd be fine, right? That, that'd be okay, right? <laughs> I think it'd be fine. And uh, there we go. Let's see. Is that a size larger than this? Yes, it was. It was literally the last wrench I tried. <laughs> oh my god. Um, and timing cover. Where did I put that? It's right here. I see. I see where it is. I, I see you. I see you over there. Trying to act like you know me. I might need to take that pulley off. Okay. All right. All right. I see your game. I see your game. Oh, man. Oh, fuck. I see how it is. There we go. <laughs> Probably should have just taken all this apart like a like a normal normal human. Like a normal human would. Like a who man. <laughs> you don't play Guessy Wrench. Guessy Wrench plays you. I think it was this size. I'm playing I'm playing expert mode Guessy Wrench, where I actually try to guess. Hey, got it on the second try. <laughs> the rod caps are ten millimeter. That'd be great if I knew what size wrenches these were. I guess that would be the size right there. 
I'll assume. <laughs> Paint some sick ass flames on that. Hey, Dominic. I wish. <laughs> I wish. Hey, Max Nobody's here. Hey, man. Nightmare Creator says, check the dump. I already did. I was already there. I'm, uh... I think I'm gonna have to cheat them back into existence. I think they clipped through the planet. And, uh... And for whatever reason, Flatari won't return them to me. Like, he won't give me the option to buy new ones. Um... I've been, I've been to Flatari's multiple times. And he's never had bearing uh, uh, main bearings even even when I had this sitting on the counter over there and I knew that it wasn't a because like the way that it works is that it determines um, it determines your 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 like what parts it gives you based on whether or not they're installed on 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 the engine um, so I had it taken off of the engine and it wasn't uh, it wasn't available at the shop. So, I don't know. <laughs> is Guessy Wrench easier, harder, or just as hard as Cuphead? Uh, it's a little bit easier. Cuphead is just, is just, is just painful ball busting, really. Um, <laughs> uh, you know what? Hold on. Here's what I'm going to do. I don't like doing this on stream because uh, because it's kind of immersion breaking, but it needs to be done. I can't continue unless I have those those uh, those bearings. So I'm gonna quit. Uh, bear with me, everybody, because I there's no way to get past this unless I cheat them back into existence. So I'm gonna quit. Um, bear with me. Bear with me. I don't like cheating, but sometimes you have to cheat in this game because. Uh, I mean, well, for, for all the reasons, you know, it didn't give me the option to buy new ones. I need them. I like, I don't want to put all this whole motor back together and then start it up and have the crankshaft fall out, you know? <laughs> so hold on a second. Um, uh, let's see. Main. And actually, you know what? I'll, I'll pull up a, uh, I'll pull up a, um, screen so you can see what I'm doing. There we go. So I've got this uh, this tool, uh, MSC Editor. And uh, and through here you can look at all of your every single part there is. So I'm looking for main main... Wait, I went past M's. You gotta know the alphabet. That's step one. Uh, main bearing. So that was main bearing three. See, it says... You know what? This, this is why. Right here. It says that they're bolted on, but they're not there. They're bolted on, but they're not installed. And uh, you can also see the damage values for this. It says that they're not damaged, but it says that they are bolted, but they're not installed. So I'm going to use um, teleport object. Uh, this this actually makes it really easy to do this. Um, main bearing 2. I'm going to teleport it to... And the kitchen table. Why not? And main bearing one. Oh, wait. oh shit. Teleport object. Main bearing one. And you have to do this when you're not in the game because it sa it saves the 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 the, uh, the game file. Main bearing one. Uh, kitchen table. Apply. There we go. And save. Close that out. And play the game there we go uh there we go and turn that off there we go perfect um <laughs> yeah the narwhal says cheating is fun unless you get caught <laughs> totes and load the year 1995 uh, Mr. Jam says, where's Russ lately? Feels like ages since you guys have all streamed together. He's he's kind of been taking a break. He's he's doing his own thing. He's working on a um, a show that he's making in Rockstar Editor, uh, which he's pretty happy about. I need to I need to record some lines for him. Um, but other than that, it's just been like we we wanted to do stuff over the weekend. I wonder if the TV works. TV hasn't been working lately. Can't turn it on. 
we've we've wanted to do some stuff o- uh, over the weekend, and each day it's like a day to day thing. Like, um, uh, you know, like oh yeah, well, uh, I, I got stuff to do today. We'll do it tomorrow, and then like tomorrow comes, and it's like ah, stuff came up last minute. Let's do it tomorrow. So we've just kind of been pushing it back. Oh wait, kitchen table, right? Kitchen table is where they should be. And there's one. Yeah, there we go. Got some main bearings now. Perfect. All right, there's one and two. And the one that I installed was three. That's the only one that I knew existed in this world. Uh, what time is it? It's six o'clock. My fatigue's up pretty high. But uh, I'm going to wait a little bit longer so that maybe I can sleep through the night. That'd be nice. Uh, there we go. Um, yeah, Narl. That's, that's right, Narl. He's busy working. He's a, he's, he's a busy man. He's a busy man. But I bet he'd be really happy to know that everybody misses him, though. Because uh, cause sometimes he doesn't feel like people do miss him. And I think that's just a depression thing. But people do, because they, they say it all the time. So if if you want to let Russ know that you miss him, um, he's at Rush Heckroth on Twitter. <laughs> Rush Heckroth. It's his, it's his fake name. <laughs> uh, oh, Simple Man says, drink a beer. Thanks for letting me know, Simple Man. I... I, uh, it's, it's, you're doing, you're doing the Lord's work reminding me to drink beer. Da, 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 da. Yeah, Narwhal's got the link. There you go. Yeah. Let him, let him know, let him know that you miss him because that would make him feel good, I think. I think most of the time he feels, he feels a bit like a, uh, like a, like a third wheel or a fifth wheel. I don't know how many wheels is inappropriate. It's, uh, and it doesn't, it's not really, it's not true. He isn't, but he feels that way sometimes. And I, uh, and I feel bad. He just, because, you know, that's just, because he's busy. He doesn't, he doesn't get to do this as much as I do. So he, he feels a little bit left out sometimes, which is understandable, but, you know, but, but that's kind of why he wants to do his own thing. Like he's doing, he's, uh, he's has plans to do more of his original channel, which is, uh, which is Hey Killer Films. I, uh, I didn't get to catch it cause I didn't know he was doing it at the time, but, um, but he, uh, he did a, he did a show a few weeks ago, uh, with, uh, with his old, with, uh, on his old, on his old, uh, channel. There we go. All right. Where's, uh, where's the last one? Where's the last piston? Right here. Oh man, this thing's going to be fucking great. There we go. <laughs> Tragic's like, he feels left out. <laughs> yeah. Tragic's often out of the loop on, on so many things. Well, we do so much solo stuff these days that a lot of times, like, it's, it's, it's almost, it's, it's rare sometimes that we do things uh, together anymore. And that's just how it works. Uh, shit. But I mean, tragic. You have you have your own channel. It's it's it was different when it's when it's uh, when it's a shared channel, like uh, like like Snake Fist Explosion is slash was, um, and like to 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 sh- to like share responsibility for something like this, and then not really be able to to do your own thing with it. Um, it's a it's a little it's a little disheartening, you know, when you put so much work into something. And I can definitely see where he where he comes from on that one. The fuck, Guessy Wrench is being a pain in my ass today. Is this is this the new the the new update for Guessy Wrench? Cause uh, cause it's I think there's some bugs. There we go. Found the found the right wrench. I guess I guess it all works out. They they added a new level of difficulty to Guessy Wrench. <laughs> Narwhal's got the link for uh, for Tragic's channel. Tragic is uh, Tragic is is a comedic genius. 
If you don't know, if you don't know Tragic's work, which you should, Tragic, Tragic just has a way with comedy <laughs> that is impossible to replicate. You you can't you can't copy that shit. It's impossible. There's there's no there's there's no alternative to tragic. <laughs> All right, and the last connecting rod. Oh shit. Um, tragic says, "When was the last time we played PUBG together?" I don't even remember to be honest. The thing about like a lot of those games is that there they there's a limitation to how many players we can have, and we always just have. Uh, oh man, hey Chris, thanks for the wow! I can't believe that worked. <laughs> thanks for uh, thanks for the pledge, man. Was that a uh, was that a renew? I I just recently was able to integrate Patreon. Oh shit! Oh, I think it's going through and uh, and doing charges. But thanks, thanks guys, thanks anyway. I don't know if you did it on purpose or if it had happened automatically, but thanks. I, uh, <laughs> God, I love that gif. And, and, and Eric, I guess, uh, I guess Patreon's going through and charging. Um, but they actually, you know, this is a good opportunity. Uh, thanks. Thanks everybody who, who supports on Patreon because, uh, cause for the last, se you know, few months, it's been t absolutely 100% the reason that I was able to keep going with, uh, with everything that we're doing on the channel. Like it's the only reason really. In a lot of ways. Oh, man. Look at all those. <laughs> Thanks, everybody. Oh, man. Um, Mick Davis says, Rush should go to Twitch uh, to feel less of a third wheel. because uh, Being on the same platform has got to help. I, I think it does. And I think he's doing uh, Hey Killer Films on, uh, on, um, on Twitch, if I'm not mistaken. I, I didn't get to... I didn't get to... Uh, to uh I didn't get to um see the one that he did but I think I know he made an account oh man I wonder how long this is gonna go <laughs> thanks thanks so much there's there's a few people that it's got to go through like 30 or 40 I think and I, I did a whole bunch the other day oh hey app 95 <laughs> Oh man, but yeah, thanks, thanks everybody that that uh, that supports through Patreon. It's it's really helpful because like, I don't know, I I really need to do more with it, and I feel really bad about it because I don't know what to do with Patreon, and a lot of times like, I gotta sp I gotta spend my time here if I can. And, like I don't want to pull people away from something else that's going on, and then when I want to do something, I need to uh, I need to do it uh, here. You know, live for everybody, you know. But uh, but there, like, there's no there's no user manual, <laughs> right? There's no user manual for uh, for Patreon. They're they're like figure it out on your own. So, uh, anyways, that's 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 what I'm saying. <laughs> oh man. Oh, is Narwhal leaving? Oh, he's got to go. His people needs him. Well. Oh jeez, John Christie, man, it's it's like it's like a Patreon bomb. It's pa it's Patreon bombing me. <laughs> um, oh, Tragic says wait till the NCBD vlog comes out. What's and is that a new CSI show? <laughs> oh, Neil Neil. T oh, that's Neil T. Oh man. Hopefully, it's not giving out people's names that they don't want. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> they don't want people to know about. Um, I'm going to jump in bed. Yeah. I'm going to jump in bed. Oh. Yeah, there's Neil T. <laughs> oh, and T-Rice. There's T-Rice. Yeah, the um, so the $45 pledge. Those are the ones that you see at the beginning and the end of the show. I never really explained any of this, but yeah. At the beginning and the end of the show, there's... um. There you see you see like four or five names, and those are the uh, the producers. Like that that tier is the producer tier, cause uh, cause that's that's a bunch. That's a lot, and there's a there's a few people that have that have uh, done more than that, and uh, and it's insane. So like, you know, like one specifically, he 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 lost his job, and he hasn't 
he hasn't been able to he, he had to cancel but i i still leave him up as a producer because he he fucking he gave so much i don't know if he wants me to out him or anything so i won't i won't say who it is but uh but i'm leaving him there because uh because i i figure he's got a few months of be, of producer status left in him <laughs> oh shit you're right i need the smoke i need to eat i need the smoke i need to drink oh my god i'm just get, i'm just getting bombed with <laughs> with the pledges oh man once once a month it's going to make things really awkward i'll have to sit here and awkwardly <laughs> wait for all of this to go through it was pretty cool though I've uh, I've never had a working a working um, alert for Patreon, and just this month they they did a, a Streamlabs did a an integration. Hey, Benton Gifford, hey man, <laughs> um, they did an integration which lets you integrate uh, Patreon. I gotta pay this. Jesus, oh hey John Saint Fraser, I haven't seen that name in a while. Oh jeez. All right. Oh, 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 geez. This is this, this is for you. This is for you, Anthony Green. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Hashtag all the Patreon people. <laughs> oh, man. I, I, it's, I really do appreciate it. And I think I've, I've been wanting to do something for like the last week or so, specifically for the Patreon people. So uh, if you're a Patreon people... Keep an eye on your on your emails, your Patreon specific emails to be exact, because because uh, something might might happen soon. I don't know when, but soon. That's the other thing. I don't have a schedule. That's the problem. Um, hey, look at this. I got a fish in here. Mmm, grilled pike. That looks so good. <laughs> Oh man! <laughs> oh, and the uh, the kill you's done. I could sell that. I need to bottle it. I need to bottle it and sell it. Um, I just realized all the lights are off in here. <laughs> Anonymous deer. Oh look! Some of these people I don't really know who they are in chat because they they use um, different names than than. Uh... Oh hey, Nightmare Crater. I know he's around here probably. Yeah, gotta lower that stress. The problem with uh, with smoking in this game is that the more you smoke, the more addicted you get. Hey, Hex there. Hey, Heck. Uh, but the more addicted you get, the the faster your stress bar goes up if you don't smoke. Hey, the Missy. That's a. There's Missy Lambert. I kind of forgot that Missy Lambert was a patron. There's there's a, a huge list, and a lot of times I don't have time to go through it see who's actually in there man it's just going on man <laughs> it's just going <laughs> uh okay let's uh yeah uh somebody said check the fish trap i forget who it was there's so much going on right now <laughs> i i'm having a hard time focusing <laughs> to, uh, to be totally honest it's uh it's 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 really distracting jv gamer <laughs> Oh man, Captain Boothead says you need more sausage. I uh, but that's the point of the fish, though. I'll never have to buy sausage again. Oh man. Oh, and Retnecks. I haven't seen Retnecks in a while. I wonder if Retnecks would want to do some, some drawings, some arts. He does good arts. He does good animu, animu, animu arts. I got one fish in here, so at least I know it works. I'm gonna let it keep going. Uh, or hold on. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna take this fish. I'm gonna cook it up. Uh, I'm gonna cook it up. Oh, is it over? <laughs> I think it's over. <laughs> well, see you all next month for the next round of uh, of <laughs> of Patreon alerts. <laughs> Jay Wit's like my identity was released. Uh, I just inadvertently doxed Jay Wit. <laughs> oh, and Alan Strickland. Hey, man. 
Thanks for stopping by. Isn't the point of Finnish summer lifestyle to kill stress? I think that's just Finnish life in general. Finland seems like a great place. I've uh, I've talked to a lot of Finnish people since making these uh, My Summer Car videos because I, I titled them all Finland Simulator. And, it, and I guess uh, Finnish people were searching things related to Finland, and a lot of them found my videos. And, uh, and they came in and like, there's parts of, of, uh, of videos where I was like, do, do, uh, do Finnish people do this or this? And they were like, and they, were, and they came in to, to weigh in as to whether Finnish people do the things I was asking if they did. All right. I need to cook this fish. I need wood is what I need. God, I need the, I need this moped just to get around. I need a piece of wood. All right, get up, up and at him. Gotta go to the woodshed. Oh, I probably didn't fill. Ah, oh, I didn't fill the gas tank yet. God damn it! <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. I got I got to get fuel. I know I got some in here, I think. I think I got some in here. Yeah, yeah. Get out of here. Cool it. Man, I didn't even fall over. <laughs> uh There there we go. There we go. All right. Um Oh, Nathan Miller says, my dad's at SEMA and is sending me amazing pics of cool cars. Oh, man. I haven't been to a car show in a really long time. I used to go to a lot of them because I'd get, um, because I, I, I owned a motorsports forum, which is owning, owning a website or a, in, in, in nowadays terms, like a YouTube channel or really anything where you weigh in about something is the easiest way to get like free tickets to things like if, if you if you make it far enough like I wasn't my website was not successful by any means like I wasn't making any money from it um, but it was just big enough that people were giving me like free passes to car shows and stuff like that which was really awesome it was worth it for that alone <laughs> so if, like I feel like I could write a book about how to get free shit on the internet just by having an opinion about it <laughs> Actually, I, I have a friend who would probably be a much better expert about that. Um, James McDonough. He, uh, he, he knows, he taught me everything I know about SEO. And he's like, you gotta start making videos about like products and stuff like that, so that people will send you free shit. And I'm like, really? And he's like, yeah, yeah. If you, if you do some product reviews, you'd be surprised how many things people send you for free. <laughs> okay. Oh, hey, there's my fireworks. There we go. Um. <laughs> Oh, uh, I was trying to figure out what James Esposito was talking about. He says this part, this part of Chad's thing is really difficult. I forgot he was making a uh, a thing for Chad. I forgot about that. All right, I've got a log. <laughs> I think Danger is addicted to beer. Oh, well, this is Finland. What are you gonna do? Drink water? <laughs> What are you, a baby? <laughs> that's what that's what babies drink. There we go. All right. I got some wood. Language Champ says, Danger, use the fan to haul wood to your house and put the extra wood in the closet in the spare room. The problem with that is that wood despawns if you when you turn off the game. Um, 
If I needed more than one log, I probably would have used the van. But it's already full of shit. I don't really want to get in it and start it up. It was easier just to hop on the moped and grab a piece of wood. Granted, I might need more than one. Either way, I'm just gonna, gonna start a fire and uh, put this put this fish there. Ah. Mmm, fish. Um, <laughs> danger, <laughs> danger! I wish I was allowed to show you. I've kind of gone full retard on the project. <laughs> it's the D DM me a pic. I won't tell anybody. I'll uh, <laughs> I'll, I, I'll, uh, I'll sign, I'll sign an NDA. How about that? Um, there we go. All right, so yeah, let's get back to building this motor then. We got a few things left. Well, I mean, by a few things, I mean the whole goddamn motor. But, uh, <laughs> uh, Alan Strickland says, last time I was in Finland, I was taken to see a movie, a joint Finnish slash Chinese martial arts film. Uh, the, the Finnish bits were, su <laughs> were subbed in Chinese and vice versa for the Chinese parts. Strangest movie I've ever seen. That makes me want to watch this movie. <laughs> oh, man. There's so many. There's so many, um... There's so many uh, uh, movies that just don't make it to America because, you know, things like that, where it's like, it's Finnish and Chinese. Like, who's going to watch a Finnish movie in America? But, like, it might be an awesome movie. You never know. What am I doing? I could probably put the oil pan on now. Probably could. I, I bet you. Ooh, I, I bet you. Yeah, I mean, why why couldn't I? All right. Uh, hey, and I got the right size and everything. Wait. Ah, yeah, I've got to I've got to bolt down that pulley. Okay. All right, that's fine. I got this. I fucking got this. All right. Um. Light Scar, hello! He says, uh, did you know uh, Mr. Dempsey suffers from chronic depression after a girl he has deep feelings for uh, left his state forever? I didn't know that. How do you know that? <laughs> That's what I want to know. But, you know, I totally understand. I was like, I, I had I had that going on when I was in the 8th grade. This girl I liked, uh, and never, like, I, I talked to her a few, like, every now and then, like, she was, she was one, she was a nice girl, like, she was, she was one that was willing to talk to me, first off, but, uh, but, uh, we never, we never really, never really got too, uh, too involved, you know, it was, it was always kind of, kind of casual, and, uh, and, uh, and 14-year-old Danger, uh, had regrets about that and uh and yeah she she moved to a different school i was super depressed <laughs> that's a deep ass oil pan damn yeah <laughs> yeah this is uh man <laughs> this is like 70s era oil pan action right here 70s era japanese oil pan Deep as fuck. <laughs> Takes like 10 quarts of oil. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> uh, oh, King Dipper says that I need a beer. You might be right. You might be right. Oop. There we go. <laughs> Forest is my name. Hello. Thanks for stopping by, man. Um, Nathan Miller says, the banger. <laughs> uh, no, no, how to build and engine. I'm 13 and took one apart and rebuilt one to make it better. What happens when danger isn't live? That's a lot of questions right there. And I don't know where to start. 
But uh, but that's pretty awesome. Thirteen's a great age to start getting into like building motors and stuff. Um, as long as you put them back together, anyways. <laughs> That's the problem I had. I took a lot of things apart and then failed to put them back together again. That's uh, that's my fatal flaw. Is that I don't like putting. Th I love taking things apart. Don't necessarily like putting them back together. <laughs> James Esposito is like I applied for a security clearance to show danger. I am waiting for the code. Oh man. Uh, but yeah, it's, uh, that was, that was, anyways, back to the eighth grade thing. Um, I think I, I think she came back at some point. I don't remember. Oh no, wait. I, okay. So, so the school that she moved to was like in the region, right? But like. It was really far away. Like, we're, we're talking like an hour and a half drive. And, uh, and you know, I'm like 14. I don't have a car. So I, so I decided that I was going to join soccer. Because uh, cause I, I liked soccer. It was like the only sport that I actually liked, to, to be fair. Um, so I was like, I like soccer, so I'm going to join soccer. And my hopes were that I would go to... I would, be, I would go to an away... Uh, game to her school <laughs> and uh, and um, and I did <laughs> but the thing is we were the worst soccer team we we won one game I think that was it we we won one game lost the rest uh, <laughs> there we go uh, but uh, but I went to her school and she was there, and uh, and one of her friends brought me a note, and uh, and and it, and and it was a uh, it was a phone number. <laughs> Even though we were losing, I got a phone number. Uh, but I was a fucking coward and I never called her. I didn't. I was a fucking idiot. <laughs> Regrets, man. Regrets. I have them. Um. You know what? I think it's time to put a gasket and a head on this thing. Where's my gasket? Mr. Gasket, where are you? I forgot about that story. Holy shit. Uh. Oh shit, Simple Man says I I live what I do. Or maybe he says I love what I do. Either way, he says been building building motors for 20 years. It's a uh, it's it's definitely it's definitely like a, a a passion thing fucking like building motors like it's something that you can do professionally but like you really have to have a passion for it to do it like you can't just be like hey, it's a living like there's there's no part of that that's like you're you're not you're you're never like I'm not that into cars I just rebuild old motors you know it's a living <laughs> uh Uh, let's see. Which, uh, fuck. Is it? Hey, I guess the, f I, I did Guessy Wrench the first time. First time go on Guessy Wrench. Let me, let me do, like, correct, uh, correct bolt tightness or something. Something related. I don't know. Fucking, it's probably a mistake. <laughs> I can't even see the other side. <laughs> Uh, there we go. Um, oh, Nathan Miller says, Danger, I have to go. I'll see you later. Happy motherfucking Halloween. See you later, man. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, da -da -da. Jeez. <sighs> I don't even know what's going on. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> I f <laughs> you know, it's, we're getting close to uh, three thousand subs. I think I should. I think I should appoint another moderator. I think it's time because you know what? Not we. Not all the moderators can be can be here all the time, and we don't have nearly enough moderators. Um, you know what? 
is uh is narwhal here wait is narwhal already a moderator <laughs> i think narwhal left didn't he hold on i gotta scroll up i gotta know uh let's see i think i already made narwhal a moderator yeah <laughs> narwhal's already a mod <laughs> Wally Benali says me. Right, that might be a good choice. Oh, man. I had Nightmare Craters here all the time. That's true. That's true. Max Nobody's here a lot, too. I feel like I had somebody in mind at some point, and I don't remember who it was. Uh, I'm doing, like cross bolt patterns like it fucking matters in this game <laughs> and it's, I'm probably not even doing it right magnum 520 is always here that's true there's I, a lot of a lot of really good options like universal deadshot here's the thing here's what I want from a moderator I want them to do nothing until they have to that's that's what I want. <laughs> uh, hey, there we go. Head bolted in. I wonder if I can put it in without a without a gasket. <laughs> I'd love there to be more performance add-ons for engine building, like you know, high high compression uh, pistons, like stroker, stroker cranks, uh, metal head gaskets. You know, forged parts and stuff like that, like a like a blue blueprinted block, a port and polished head, a larger camshaft. Like these would all be great things to add to this game. I wish uh, I wish it had it. Um. <laughs> James Esposito's like danger. You're near a phone. Uh, near a phone that works. I'm not. <laughs> I'm really not. Um. I don't, yeah, I don't think I'm forgetting anything. I think I'm doing all of this right. Oh, Joseph Brewer says you can buy suspension and some other stuff at the store. You mean from the from the catalog? Is there suspension now? Let's see. Um, oh, I should get some of these. Because that was one of the things that I wished that they had was, uh, was uh, some upgraded suspension. Oh, yeah. Oh. There is upgraded suspension. Ha. Huh. Ha. Huh. That's expensive, but, uh. Oh, man. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, <laughs> the fight for mod powers. <laughs> I mean, I don't have nearly enough money. I think I get this stuff half off anyway, don't I? Or is that just from Flatari? Yeah, I didn't. Thanks, thanks for reminding me, Joseph. I didn't even, I didn't even, I didn't even look in there. To be honest, I haven't looked in there in a long time. I'm gonna plug the phone back in because uh, I think I'm waiting for one more call. Yeah, one more call for for the shit truck. <laughs> I'm just calling it the shit truck. The shit wagon. Let's just call it the shit wagon. This thing's coming together. I'm really happy about this. This whole this whole thing. Oh man. I'm <laughs> Hey, NWO Cody, hey man. Happy Halloween to you too, man. Oh wait. Oh shit, I meant to check. Okay. I didn't know if I had a message or, or not. Uh, oh, not that. That's not what I'm trying to do. This. There we go. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh, there you go. Fucking... <laughs> Just Brewer's like, sorry for any spoilers. I, I don't really think... that. See, that's not really a spoiler. That's just something that's in the catalog. And, uh... 
I mean, sure, I probably would have found it eventually, but it's not like it's not like a huge discovery or anything. It's probably something I should have known was in there for a long time. Oh, jeez. <laughs> don't. Oh, yeah. Don't forget the fish. That's right. Is the fish done? Hey, the fish is done. Hey, so uh, so one log was enough to kill a to to <laughs> it was enough to kill a fish. Um, it was enough to cook a fish. And I can just pile a whole bunch in there, and I really only need one log, I guess. So that's pretty cool. Uh, <laughs> Jay trolls, so people already know how to kill Jason. <laughs> Yeah, totes. Um, man. There's a lot of good options for mods. I'm still I'm still I'm still thinking about it. Uh Jesus Christ. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> um <laughs> Man, it's it, like I'm at a point where it's hard to decide, to be honest, because there's a lot of people that are here a lot and a lot of people that be really good for the job. Um, yeah, I don't know. Man, I, re I really do need to set up my uh, my blacklist again. I had, a, I, had a, I had a blacklist that would take care of pretty much all of uh, all. <laughs> All of everything that just happened in the chat. It would have taken care of it immediately. <laughs> but I, I haven't installed it because I haven't needed anything like that on Twitch. Not yet. It's not like YouTube where people are just animals. Just a bunch of fucking filthy animals. <laughs> oh, man. Enigma Champ says, choose me, danger. You're already a mod, Enigma Champ. You got a th sword right there. <laughs> oh, the phone's ringing. It's that guy. I know it is. Hello? Totally. I'll be right there eventually. <laughs> oh, I need a beer bad. There we go. All right. This thing's coming together slow and steady, but it's, but it's coming together. Uh. Let's see. Oh, that's not the right size. It's not the right size. It's not the right size. Oh, there we go. Okay. Uh, fuck, how big is this? That's what she said. <laughs> Do you, does everybody know where that's what she said came from? So, uh, it originally was uh was used in the early 1900s and originally it was said the actress to the bishop you see and then it just became that's that's what she said but because because it's uh i don't know i can't fucking i don't know why it was said the actress to the bishop but uh i don't know it, it came from there I looked it up because I was like, I have to know where this comes from. <laughs> Forrest is my name says the office. No, it didn't come from the office. <laughs> that said, they did a good job on the office with uh, that's what she said. I haven't, I watched like the first four seasons of the office, but I was watching them with this girl that I was dating. She was obsessed with the office. And then uh, she turned out to be um, a bitch. <laughs> Hold on, I'm coming. I'm coming. Hello. Oh, it's the firewood guy. Yeah, yeah, I'll I'll deliver some firewood. That one pays really well, and it takes like almost like I used to not like doing the firewood job because I was like, man, it takes a long time. But it actually doesn't. It doesn't take that long. Oh man. Uh oh shit. So um 
So in in Archer, I I love Archer by the way. I watch Archer every day. It's how I go to sleep. But uh, but they did the they they did that's what she said for a, a, a few episodes. But then in season five, uh, they started well no in a few a few times earlier than that they tried to throw they they were trying to do phrasing and they couldn't and, they, and some of them couldn't get phrasing right so uh so like they started doing um fuck who said it i think it was cyril or uh, archer said it first he said said the android bishop or said said ripley to the android bishop because it's the said the actress to the bishop because it's played by sigourney weaver it's like it's it's that high level that high level shit <laughs> that uh that unless you know the etymology of that's what she said you don't get it <laughs> like it's that's why I love that's why I love Archer because there's just so much shit like that where it's like <laughs> it's like there's there's no way that you would have gotten that joke unless. You to like unless you absolutely knew where that where that phrase came from. When you got to get on Wikipedia to un to fully understand the depth of a joke, <laughs> that's that's when I start to enjoy a show. <laughs> uh, let's see. Aha! Of course, that's where it, it connects. All right, this is really coming together now. I'm I'm. I'm feeling I'm feeling good about this. I'm feeling positive. Okay, here we go. Uh, perfect. This is the one wrench I need to put everything on. Um. Uh, there we go. All right. <laughs> Sam T for mo for mod. Sam Thunder would be a good mod. But do I really need two mods who's, who have blue names? These are the questions I have to ask myself. Yeah, and Sam Thunder's like, that's why I like Family Guy. All of the older references. I like, I, I like, I like something where the, the jokes are obscure enough where they're funny when they say them, but then, like, after the third or fourth time watching that episode, you're like, ha! It means a different thing entirely. <laughs> this joke has so many levels. Oh man, <laughs> are we not done? Are we not doing phrasing? I really need to know if we're bringing phrasing back into the <laughs> back of <into> the rotation. <laughs> Where are we standing on phrasing? Uh, what size was this? Does anybody remember this one right here? It's pretty big. That's what she said. Said Ripley to the android bishop. <laughs> ah, that's the one. <laughs> Dumbasses for mud. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Sam Thunder's like, how do I change my text color? Well, well, might have to figure that out. Um, uh, oh, maybe because you're on beta? It could be. You might have to switch off beta for a second. It's possible. Okay, so what do we have? Oh, I got to put the drive gear on. Did this thing fall off? Because, uh... I don't remember taking the drive. Oh, right. Okay, it goes here. Right. The drive gear. Got it. Boom. Tough acting to act. It's already screwed in. I didn't even unbolt that one. It just came off. Oh, and that needs to be bolted in. Right. Right there. You know, it's been a long time since I've done any of this stuff. Oh, that's all, that was already bolted. Some of the stuff's already bolted, and uh, I don't have to do anything with it. 
So, let's see. I've got to be missing something. Got the carburetors on. Uh, huh. I think that's it. Oh. I mean, it'd be, o it'd be over here if there was anything. Or on the table or under it. I think I did everything. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to move this bad boy over here. And uh, do something with it. I don't even remember how to connect this thing. Maybe I gotta carry it over. Just lift up the whole motor. And... No? Maybe I gotta take something off to bolt this on. Uh... Oh no, right here is one location. Uh, yeah, so it should be like so. Or like so. I forget how to use this. Hold on. Let's see. I wonder if I just start screwing it in, if it'll just go in. You know? If I just screw it, Phrasing. Maybe it'll just go. You know? You know what I mean? Does anybody know? <laughs> oh, yeah, the starter. The starter. Where the hell's the starter? I knew I was forgetting something. Yeah, the starter definitely needs to go on. I don't know where it is, though. Did I already put it on? Let's see. Maybe I already put it on. I will figure it out later. <laughs> that's a uh, that's that's a, that's a future danger problem. You know, we don't have to worry about that now. That's a, that's a problem for danger in the future. That's not a danger in the present. Oh yeah, it's right there. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Adidas. I <laughs> uh, what fucking size is this? There we go. If I just bolt this in, maybe. Maybe it'll just work, you know? No go. Oh, see? There we go. Perfect. I just started bolting it, and now it's good. Works for me. <laughs> good enough for government work. Oh, wait. No. It didn't work. What the fuck? What the fuck? It's not working. It's no good. It's no good. Huh. Uh. Uh. <laughs> Sam Thunder is like, changed my color just for you, danger. Wow, thanks. Thanks, Sam Thunder. You know, just for that, I'm gonna make you a mod. There you go. <laughs> Sam Thunder's a new mod! <laughs> does, danger, does red work better for you? Or should I go pink? <laughs> as long as it's not blue, I don't give a shit. 
But then again, now I now I don't I won't know what to think. Um <laughs> Oh, congrats, Sam. I think you'll be a great moderator, Sam. I think you'll be one of the best. Son of a bitch. What do I have to do to make this thing work? Oh, there we go. There we go. All right. Got it. Let's see, now let's just put this uh, starter wherever the starter goes, right? That looks like a place where a starter would go. Boom. Oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. You know, my goal, I want to race this thing. And I want to race it this week. It's been, I've been playing this game for a goddamn year. I have yet to race this car. I've yet to race it. I think it's time to race. There we go. <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay. And uh, one, one more. There we go. That one back there is already done. Right? Right. Probably. Give it a once over. Let's 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 make sure everything's correct. That's that's bolted in. That's good. The alternator will need tightening, but I'll wait until I get it in the car to do that, because I gotta adjust it anyways. Uh oil oil filter needs tightening. What's uh Oh, that's the uh, coolant. That'll be that'll be for coolant. Okay. All right. Hey, I'm not saying. Hey, man. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if you were here before, but I'm saying hi now. <laughs> On oh, Tasmania. Hey, man. I'm uh. I'm doing. I'm. I'm. I'm just doing this now. This is, this is just my life right here. Oh, there we go. All right, that should be good. Oh yeah, remember how this uh, this thing was clipping through the uh, was clipping through the uh, the grill? So I took the sledgehammer and just beat it in a little bit, <laughs> just like I would in real life. All right, let's get it in there. Does that mean you have no life danger? I don't know what you're talking about. What are you talking about? What are you talking about, JB Gamer? What are you what are you talking about? Alright. It's a little uh could, could come back a little bit. This is always my least favorite part. Of working on a car, cause uh, cause it was so scary. It's so scary putting a motor into a car because it's so heavy, and you spend so much time and money making the motor and the car, and then you're like, is it gonna, is it gonna go in and then like break something off? And you know what 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 happens what happens when I get it in there? Do I just do I just bolt it in? What do I do? I don't know what to do. What do I do? What do I do? That's uh, it's me in real life, working on cars. That's my life, not knowing what to do. So uh, the mounts down there. I just need to get one for it to to line up into place, and then I can get the rest pretty easily. Uh, but I need the right size wrench, which is probably pretty big. I'd imagine. So let's see, it's gonna be right here. I guess, I'm guessing that's not the right size. 
Don't forget about the oil and stuff. Yeah, yeah, I definitely won't forget about that. That's one thing you do not want to forget. <laughs> oil, coolant. Coolant's a little bit more forgiving. When you when you when you start up a car without coolant, you you have some you have some time to figure it out, you know? But if uh if you start up a car without oil, you have significantly less time. <laughs> I doubt I doubt the motor mounts are this small. Fucking like seven millimeter wrenches. It's gotta be like a it's gotta be like a twelve or higher, I'd imagine. Oh, ah, jeez. Ah, fuck. God damn it. There we go. Alright. I'm gonna just lower it a little bit. Because it's pretty close. Maybe two pumps. Give it two pumps. Oh, it's so goddamn close. Look how fucking close that is. Push it back a little bit. Oh, yeah. I had a friend named Tony. He was half Vietnamese. And he was a fucking wizard. Oh, I wasn't even looking at the right bolt. Or did that just show up? I think it just showed up. I'm going to say it did. Because I don't want to believe that I was just looking in the wrong location for a bolt. Um, and he always helped me put motors in cars. Because he, he just had an eye for it. We'd have some precariously balanced motors. There we go. We have some precariously balanced motors. And he'd be like, ah, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. It's fine. I'd be like, I don't know. I feel like it's going to hit the firewall. And he's like, yeah, it probably will. And I'm like, is that bad? And he's like, no, oh, maybe. <laughs> and then he'd just ram it in there and it'd be fine. I, I couldn't do anything without Tony. Tony was great. Tony Tony was a real chap, is what he was. But you know what happened with old Tony? Man. It's kind of a sad story. He tried he he uh he he tried to he tried to bang my other friend's girlfriend. And I had to choose a side. Don't you hate when that happens when you're when it's like Tony, I'm really good friends with you, but I'm also friend with this friends with this other guy who you're trying to you're trying to get with his girlfriend. And now I gotta choose one of you, which I, I was hoping I, I wouldn't have to do. But now you're you're forcing my hand and making me do that thing that I don't I don't want to do, which is choose. I want both. Yeah, it was a rough time. <laughs> the moral of the story is if uh, if a friend of yours has a girl, and you're kind of into her. You gotta let it go. It's not worth it. You lose friends over that. That's the that's the easiest way to lose a friend, is to uh. It's 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 the easiest way to lose a lot of friends. Really, is try to force force everybody to pick sides, and they're not gonna pick sides with the guy that's trying to bang their friend's girl. <laughs> Danger choo choo chooses you. <laughs> Did Tony become Anthony? Yeah, that's uh, that's what happened. He became Anthony, and it's too bad because he was, you know, he's a he's a cool guy. He was fun. He was really funny. You know, he's a funny guy. I really liked being around him, but he, uh, he 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 went into the danger zone. Is what happened, and and I was just coming off of a off of a breakup like that where a friend of mine was uh, uh decided to bang my girlfriend. So, <laughs> you know, what, what was I going to do? Tell my other friend, like, I kind of want to be friends with Tony still. You know, I don't think it's a bit that big of a problem. And he's like, yeah, but the same thing just happened to you, man. And then I'd be like, yeah, but it's different because it's not me now. Oh, man. Oh, uh, Chad says going much longer. I don't know. Yeah, maybe. Why? What's what's uh, what's 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 going on? What's going on? You you gonna you gonna do a streamy stream because I can uh, I can finish up if you're doing a streamy stream because because uh, look at this I just got the motor back in the car and uh, and I can uh, I can throw some some uh, some fluids in 
Yeah, I can uh, I can put in some of these these here fluids. Get it all. Where the fuck does this go? Jesus Christ. <laughs> I don't know where this goes. I think this is the lower hose, right? Oh, oh, I just saw it. I just saw it. Hold on. Hold on. I just, I, it was right over here. It's the lower hose. I know that. I could throw some fluids in, get this thing running, and then, and then we could run on over to a, to a, to a Chad Why Not joint. I'm calling them joints now. <laughs> Cause, uh, cause I think I feel it's appropriate. Uh, God, I for for a second, for a second, I had the option. I had I had an opportunity and I let it slip. Okay, I'll do the other ones. Um, oh, Chad says he might draw. That'd be cool. Oh, jeez. There, there we go. All right. And then where does the fuck does this go? This might be the lower. These, uh, these, 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 this hose setup is really weird. Uh, fuck. How the fuck did... Shit. Uh. Oh, come on. Maybe it goes over here. I don't think it does, though. Um, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll, uh, I'll go ahead and, and once, once this thing runs, once I turn the key and this thing runs, we can, uh, we can run on over to the, uh, the Chad Why Not joint. There we go. Got it. All right. And that won't take too long. Maybe, maybe five or 10 minutes stops. Cause, uh, cause, cause I'm a fucking wizard in this game. Like a moon wizard. I just gotta find where this thing. I gotta. I gotta find where this collides. A lot, not unlike Power Man Five Thousand. Uh, shit. Where he, uh, you know, if you know anything about Power Man Five Thousand, um, they pontificated. Power Man Five Thousand pontificated what it would be like if worlds collided. And. uh... Boy, he, he found out. The Power Man found out. He knew. He knew for sure. Once, uh, once he saw, he's like, "Yep, that's that's what happens." Oop! Right there. Perfect. Got it. All right. Now we just gotta fill this shit up and uh, and give it a go. Give it a give it a right a right slathering of oh shit. I gotta put those in. Well, I can start it up anyways. I should be able to start it up without the without the uh, the drive shafts in. That shouldn't be a problem. That should not be a problem. All right. I got the motor oil. I got the oils for the for the slick goodness for the lubrication. I've got the lubricating. Oh shit! It started doing it like over here. There we go. There we go. Um. Oh shit! Unknown sciences. Oh my god! Bethesda went overboard with the new Wolfenstein. Very racist. Like racist as in their depiction of races, or racist as in the characters in the game are Nazis and they want to kill people that are other races. Um, <laughs> uh, James Esposito says, I asked Danger what he thought about two strokes, and he told me he didn't know. It always takes him way more than that. Ah, it does. It takes me way more than two. <laughs> you got me there, James. Takes me more than two strokes. I'm a four-stroke kind of guy myself. <laughs> uh, 
Unknown Saiyan says, Nazi and KKK members are getting along in America. Is that what the game is about? Because that just sounds realistic. That just sounds like a thing that happens. <laughs> oh, and, and P Zeta. Hey, hello. Hi. Thanks for stopping by. I'm almost done, though. And uh, and if Chad would uh, would 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 start up his stream, I'm about to turn the key on this thing and find out what's what, and then we could go raid Mr. Chad, because Chad's gonna draw, and it's gonna be great, probably. <laughs> yeah, Kembu had to like so basically America right now. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Yeah. Oh, simple man's gotta go. See you later, man. Yeah. <laughs> James Esposito says, hating Nazis is not racist. Nazi is not a race. That's right. The Aryan Brotherhood is a race, I guess. Is it? I don't know. I guess Aryan technically is a race. Oh, look at this. I didn't even realize. Oh, look at this. You can check. I didn't even know that this was a thing. You could use... I mean, it makes sense. I mean, it's been there the whole time. But, uh, I had no idea. All right, this is the moment of truth here. This is the moment of truth. I'm kind of nervous. I, I'm not going to lie. I'm kind of nervous. Um, shit. God. Um, well. <laughs> It didn't even uh, didn't even turn over, so that's and the bumper fell off. <laughs> Get out of your bumper! All right, so what am I missing here? I'm missing something. Maybe I'll start with a starter. Maybe maybe the starter starter needs something. What's that? That looks like something where something would go. Huh. What would go there? I don't know. Oh, you know what? Hold on. Danger, you need a new battery. Maybe. I mean, it, it, it would make more sense if it was a wiring thing, but I don't know how much wiring there is in here. I think it's all automatic. Yeah, because... Uh, wait, hold on. Here's... Here's the... Coil? I guess, yeah, coils there. Then, then the, uh, the distributor going to the spark plugs. There's, uh, I mean, do I have to, I mean, I, I don't, hold on. Maybe I gotta, maybe I gotta charge this thing? Hey, I mean, maybe. I don't know. Do I have to turn this on? Huh. I don't know. I mean, it would make sense if the battery was dead. But uh, my, but my first instinct is to is to look over all of my work first and see if there's an obvious reason why it won't turn over. To which, I don't believe that there is any obvious reason. It doesn't seem like there is. I mean, but it's a video game. It's not based on... It's not exactly based on reality, so... There's no telling. Maybe it's just, like, it doesn't detect a motor or something, you know? <laughs> like, it doesn't detect a certain factor in in the programming, so it doesn't turn anything over. Or the battery's dead. I don't know. Could be either, I suppose. Oh, this is a good view of, of, of this. Of the, uh, of the tie rod. I mean, it could also be that I don't have to drive shafts in. <laughs> Shoot fireworks at it? Yeah, that'll... That'll, uh... That'll, uh... That'll, that'll, that'll do it. I mean, I guess this is on? It'd be nice if this made a noise or something, but, uh... Let's see. Let's, uh, let's throw it back in. Maybe, maybe, maybe I can get a... Maybe I can get a crank, you know? Maybe I can get it to, to, to like, whir over.
I mean, it doesn't say that it has any battery power, so I guess that's got to be it, right? That's got to be it. Because, I mean, this gauge would show me if I had battery power. Okay. So that's got to be it. Anyways, I think... Uh, I think that does it. I'm gonna I'm gonna throw like the drive shafts back in off camera because you don't need to see that shit. And I'll charge this battery. And uh, and uh, I'll I'll will see what's up. And then uh, then the next time we do this, I'll probably uh, I'll probably be good to go. Wait, are the is the are the lights up? Hold on a second. The lights. There's no power. There's no, there's no power. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on a second. There's no power. There's no electricity. Is there a fuse box? Where, where would the fuse box be? That's why the TV doesn't work. There's no electricity. And the refrigerator's open. Hold on. Let me eat some sausage and drink a beer. This is that this is some serious business going on. Is there a fuse box in here? What the hell's going on in here? Yeah, the sauna's not on. You know what? I'm gonna here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go to sleep. Because I, I have a sneaking suspicion. Danger, you didn't pay the bill. There is no bill. What is going on? Yeah, there's no... There's no electricity. What the... F what the fuck? Why is there no electricity? <laughs> what the fuck is going on? Is it because of the lightning? Is there a fuse box somewhere? Does anybody know? Oh. Rico Kart says, yes, there is. Look in the mailbox. I have a mailbox? Hold on. Where's the mailbox? Is it down here? Is this the mailbox? Is this my mailbox? Oh my god, are you serious? <laughs> really? Is this my mailbox? Open mailbox. For real? Are you are you for real? Come on. Uh okay. Um 1,342 marks. I had just enough. I had just enough money to pay my electric bill. What the fuck? And, and uh, really? Really? There, I can't, I can't believe it. I did not know that there was a fucking mailbox. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh my God. So wait. I mean, I've never, I've never had to pay a, a bill before, so maybe that means that like it's the end of the month. Have I been, have I been playing this game for a month in game time? Probably longer than that, right? I don't know. Oh yeah, and the charger makes makes noise. <laughs> Oh my god. All right. Wow, well, that's <laughs> that's interesting. <laughs> uh, your name is Watson? Yeah, Randy Watson. Oh my god. I can <laughs> that that's something. I I had no idea. Okay. <laughs> Oh, what it, what the hell is slamming over here? Is it this? Yeah, it's that. Get out of here! Go slam into things somewhere else. Okay, well. <laughs> that, 
that was that was fucking that was that was nuts oh yeah yeah and this is working right here okay and now this has been charging for a little bit I wonder if I can get a crank out of it I mean I probably gotta leave it on there longer than that but just the same oh come on come on don't be a shit don't be a dirty rotten shit okay there we go and now, if I turn the key on this, maybe I can get a, a crank out of it? No. Okay, I'm going to have to charge that for a while. Anyways, <laughs> I, can't, I can't believe... That's, a, that's fucking crazy. I didn't even know that was a thing in this game. And I've been playing this game for a year! <laughs> oh, well, th anyways, thanks everybody for, uh, for hanging out tonight. I, I really appreciate it. Uh... <laughs> I'm going to have to charge this battery. I'm going to have to see how long I have to charge this thing for. Um. <laughs> oh, God. Anyways, uh, thanks, thanks everybody for hanging out. This was, uh, this was great. Two days in a row. My summer car. I might, I might do this again because uh, I really want this thing to run. Um, but anyways, let me just roll some good old-fashioned credits. Like... So, oh man, um, yeah, check out that. Thanks, thanks, uh, thanks for the new followers, and uh, and thanks JJ Collins, Magnum Five Twenty, and Enigma Champ, Bad News Brian, Narwhal, Sam Thunder, and Desiru for the for the cheers. Thanks, thanks a whole bunch. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing tomorrow, but we'll we'll see, we'll see. Um, but in the meantime, we're gonna go over and raid Chad. Uh, so so let Chad know who they're messing with. Let him, let him know, let him know what time it is. Cause he's going to go drawing. He's going to draw and, uh, and I'll host that right after the end. But thanks everybody for watching and, uh, see you tomorrow. Goodbye everybody. Goodbye. Goodbye.